Warning, there are jump scares ahead. Please proceed with caution. So this is apparently a trend now. We just go back to the older games of Five Nights at Freddy's. But Alfie, I thought you would have done a, a video on Five Nights at Freddy's. They are. Well, with my current device, for some reason, doesn't allow me to. I found out that you would require Android 10 for AR Core, and if you don't have AR Core, then you can't have Five Nights at Freddy's AR Special Delivery, and that comes out in September. So, September will be the month where I make a game play a video of this. Let's see if we can't beat night three because I've managed to get through the first two nights and yes, I'm using cheats. I, I am a complete scaredy cat when it comes to these games. Even though I've played these games so many times, I still get scared. Not pretty much by the jump scares, but rather because of the fact that I'm worried that I might get jump scared rather than the actual jump scared. Jump scares. Oh, Foxy, you are one picky bean. You want to be the first the encounter of night three. I'm using fast nights. The radar and unlimited power. You may judge me after the video. And yes, I will be attempting to edit this. Yeah, I edit my own videos. Because no one wants to me edit my videos because you would have to rewatch them and no one likes my videos. But if you do, then leave a like. Yeah, all the robots come from there. But I'm just going to like feed you info about this. That is the music that plays when an animatronic is approaching the vent in these two little side vents or right in front of you so in this case with a chica we'll we'll climb into these vents and we'll get into my office now this really does help it's a good way of making money and is also a really good way of keeping track of who is after you besides literally everybody now certain now as long as everyone stays in their place like you see with the cheeker doesn't even have hands but once it, the with the cheeker icon comes to the U part. That's when I know to put my mask on. In some games, there's actually a broken glitch where you put on a mask but you can look through your monitors. That can't be good for your eyesight. Fiddling with my hair. That's not what I want. You may be like, Alfie, but with a burn it's in the hole. Those can't actually attack me from their current position. I'm really not liking this because Foxy's in the hole and Foxy is not fooled by the Freddy head trick. We think they do. I'm gonna get jump scared, I know it. Saved by the chiming of the clock. Also, at 6 a.m., how do you make it out alive? Oh yeah, these cutscenes. They're not really cutscenes though. 
Okay, now that is not creepy at all. I, I think they've caught on. Ah! Oh! I'm, I'm just a regular Royal Freddy. Hey! Hey! It's me in the corner. It's me it was in the corner. Coincidence? I think not. But on the sixth night, Golden Freddy is able to make an appearance. There's something scary about Freddy Fazbear's. Is that Chuck E. Cheese is going bankrupt, and now there's loads of rumours that Scott Cawthon is going to take over and turn it into Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Oh, hi, Mangle. For some reason, you decided not to show yourself last night. These things happen sometimes. Oh! I wonder if I wonder if they're possessed or not, because as we know already, these animatronics here are possessed by children that were murdered at their pizzeria, and this is actually updated because FNAF, one of the largest steps an indie horror game could have taken was taken. Scott Cawthon moved his games over to console. You've got a PlayStation, you want to play for FNAF on it? Now you can. Um, They're not as cheap as the mobile games, but we all know how it is with, mo with console games. Some of them are just two seconds to make Cash grabs. People think that Mangle is a dog. No joke. People believe that a dog was killed and then the soul of the dog. Hello, Mangle Wangle. You like to dangle. Ah, I'm going to get jump scared. I don't know what. So, mm. it's not shifty at all. You're not letting me wind the music box up, are you? on another person enters your room that you can't check your monitors to see if they're there the music box is the biggest problem also it used to be also sorry if you hear any creaking or squeaking that's just because I have a gaming chair, but it's not your regular spinny chair. It's a rocking chair. And no, it's not one of those horse ones. God, Bonnie's moved already. There's also a, a little Easter egg. <clears throat> 
where if everyone has left the room. Oh yeah, for some reason Chica's like pushed off to the side, but when Withered Body leaves, Chica changes position. Okay. Now it's time to get all the theory in. And FNAF news. So, there are, there is no new FNAF news yet. Besides, you know, the new book series, damn Foxy, if you were a dog, then you would want treats every 15 seconds. Not even a minute after you disappear, abracadabra, here I am. Balloon Boy, can you shut up? You're a little gremlin. Yeah, everyone's saying that the devil is not Satan, but rather Balloon Boy. For some reason, as soon as I hear that second laugh, a hello <laughs> is all I need. There's an intro coming. There's a um, jump scare coming. This is why. Three, two, one. Foxy got me before the pup. You know what I find weird? Oh, mini game. Usually it would turn a screen of grey. Also, a really cool thing is in the title screen. Every, like, frame, one of the withered animatronics for literally one frame will replace the toy animatronics and then a different one will be, like, like in the title screen. Also, people wonder, is with a Chica or with a Bonnie the most broken? The answer is <gasps> Withered Bonnie. Because it's not just his mask face, it's actually his endoskeleton face. Also, what really doesn't make sense about this, besides the entire story, is how do they end up possessed? But there's an endoskeleton which would operate the robot. Do they possess the suit or the endoskeleton? The new face of fun? More like the new face of child and night guard head chomping. You see, one reason why Balloon Boy isn't very fun to deal with is because with Foxy you need to flash your light at him if you don't
Also, if Foxy is jumping at me from that, far away, he's got to have some leaping skill. I might be done here. Only one way to find out. Nope, not dead. Yet. God! What? He pulled down my monitor. Usually, if you put your mask on, as soon as they bring down your monitor... Give gifts, give life. This lets us know that the animatronics are possessed. St because with the regular kids, every kid possesses an animatronic so they can get revenge on the purple guy. Makes sense in a way, but also the fact that their bodies were stuffed in as well. Sorry about the audio quality. I am not wearing a microphone as for none of them work. And I just decided, why not? Yeah, Golden Freddy makes an appearance in Night 6. And Custom Night. People say Golden Freddy is a hallucination. But that can't be the case because how could two different people have the exact same hallucination? One just beat up. That's the only difference. A missing ear and just wires popping out. That's it. Also, in one of the new stories, New Kid, that puts in an entire new person and makes us question who is Golden Freddy? Cassidy Matt Pat or the game theorist thought was Golden Freddy in this new one a kid called Kelsey is new to a school and makes friends with the people that no one wants to be friends with. Sounds like a pretty nice person. That person. Kelsey was perfect. Everything someone could like. Attractive. Nice personality. But then, Devon the person who was... Wait. No. Mangle should be present in this hallway. Also makes you wonder... WTF. No, don't get on me now. It's not the game that's glitchy for me. It's my device as soon as I hear that hello I am mask on wait Foxy is still in the hall oh god now we're gonna get jump scared by withered bonnie Or not. This game is so fancy with the way you're jump scared. And not in a good way either. Just as soon as one goes away, another one comes. Right, Foxy's gone. Now we just have to figure out who's coming into my room. Mangle! See what I was... I was talking...
saying earlier about the way you are jump scared. As soon as one goes away, another one appears. That statement is present. Mangle goes away, and then as soon as Mangle goes away, with a Chica comes. So all I want to know is why can't all of them have sound cues? What's concerning me the most is that all three of the regular toy animatronics aren't deciding to be present. Oh god. Oh my god. Night five's gonna be a pain. Because if that was hard enough, hard. Now oh, great. You know how in FNAF 3, you know the Phantom Puppet? Yeah, this is what reminds me of the Phantom Puppet. Also, why are you doing this, Puppet? Are you giving gifts, giving life? Also, how was it last night? All of them were looking at me, but now the Puppet's the only one looking at me. Also, the constant hole in the robot suit. But what is wrong with it? I'm the exact same as everyone else, or am I? Am I just a guard who is stuffed into a suit? And can move? Am I putting traps? But instead of Freddy. Could, could I be Freddy Trap? That would be kind of low key, sir. What's concerning me? Is the robot? Oh, oh, hey, good job, nice five. Um, hey, uh, keep a close eye on things tonight, okay? Uh, from what I understand, the building of our lockdown, uh, you don't want to go out in our house, you know, especially concerning any previous employees. Uh, when we get it all sorted out, we may move you to the day shift, and position in the case available. Uh, we don't have a replacement for your shift yet, but we're working on it. That's where the first incidents happened. The spring lock failures. Yep, that's that's the sign that Foxy's ready to move. You gremlin, you must stay out of my room before I must have God murder you.